Today is a quick tip video on profiles, specifically how to get the ability to transfer your car's profile to the cloud. With updates over the last few months, you now have the ability to use your car's profile, which has many saved settings for drive mode, seat adjustments, and other personalizations. You can save the profile to the cloud and then use it in another Tesla vehicle. For example, if you rent a Tesla Model 3 or Y, you can use your profile in that car and have it customized with your settings. First, on your car screen, go to the Profiles tab at the top. At the bottom of the drop-down menu, select Driver Profile Settings. Your Tesla account will show up at the top of the list. It will also have your account's email address just below the name. Press this account and you will now see a prompt on the right side of the screen. Set up your Tesla profile. Your vehicle settings and preferences will travel with you across supported Tesla vehicles. Copy settings from existing profile. Since my main settings are saved to Matthew, I will use this as my existing profile. Press Setup. Once you do that, it will show that the profile was synced one hour ago. If you ever need to update or change your account profile to a different existing profile, you can just do the same procedure again. You will now see that the profile on the top of the screen has changed from just the name to the account name and photo that's associated with that account. Here's a close-up of the profile menu when you press the drop-down box. You can always choose another profile if you wish, or just keep using the Tesla account profile, it's up to you. When you use a rental car, you could just log into your account and choose the profile with the car. Of course, if you have a Model 3 or Y, the settings and preferences will be similar compared to that if you rent a Model S or X, which has slightly different settings and preferences. If you want to set up other Tesla profiles associated with the driver email accounts, you could do so by sending an invitation from the Tesla phone app to the other person. And that's it for today's quick tip. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video.